Hey fellow Star Citizens, Scrapchat here. On leave of the drop of uh, 3.17.2, I thought I'd share my final version of how to sell items using voice attack. What is voice attack you say? It is a program you install on your PC that allows you to turn verbal commands into uh, keystrokes, otherwise known as macros. In 3.17.1, .1, the backend was having issues allowing me to sell more than a couple of items before freezing up. I'm not seeing that problem in 3.17.2, so I thought now would be a good time to uh, share this macro as, as it is uh, not so much a time saver as it is an annoyance saver. You probably still take just as long to sell uh, a lot of items from your loot, but at least you can sit back and have a cold one while VoiceTac does all the hard work. I won't be building this macro from scratch uh, like I did with the others, but instead we'll go over each step and we'll uh, include the steps in the description. You'll need to adjust the, the movements depending on your resolution though. Alright, let's get started. Okay, so let's start with a uh, little demonstration of exactly what Cell Item does. Um, I'm here in Crew L1 and I have uh, just a ton of scopes that I've been looting um, at, from different locations around Stanton. And I want to sell them. Normally, this would just take forever I would I don't this is one part of looting I can't handle is is the sell the actual selling part um, but now now in uh, 3.17.2 I think the um, I think the ability to sell using uh, using voice tech I think actually is is working now so what I do is I to, to actually sell an item actually multiple items I hover over the uh, first item and then I just say the command sell item now as you can see it's actually doing all the movement I'm just kind of sitting here and it'll continue and as long as I have all of my uh, uh, directions correct as far you know as far as like how far to move it should always be on the sell buttons when it clicks now, as you can see it's really not that much faster than doing it by hand but I could walk away from the terminal I could go get you know go talk to the wife whatever I don't have to be sitting here clicking I can just let let the uh, let the voice tech do all the work so I find it kind of handy I like it I'd say it's probably about as handy as the move move item uh, uh, macro that I did a video for uh, a couple weeks ago Alright, I think that's enough of a demonstration. So to, to actually um, stop the uh, voice tag from continuing, uh, if you look at one of my other videos, you'll see that we have a stop all command. So I will use that. Oh, there we go. Now, stop all. Stop all. Voice tech actually is pretty smart. If I if I use if I'm speaking like I am now, and then I use a, a command too close to uh, the rest of my conversation, it'll ignore it and it'll let you continue talking. So I obviously I <clears throat> I use that command too soon to when I was just speaking just now. So how does this work? This is a little complicated. There's a kind of a lot of steps to it. I'm not going to actually create it from scratch, like I said. I'm going to actually just go over it with you here. So let me pull it in. Onto the screen here. And as you can see, uh, if you've seen any of my other videos, you're, you should be familiar with the screen. Uh, basically, when I say sell item, the command will kick off. Uh, and then here's a list of all the different um, actions that the macro will take. And, we, and what I do is initially I have to start with by putting the the cursor on right on the center of the first item I want to sell um, in the upper left corner. So once I have it right in the center there, that's where it'll come back to at the end. And then it'll just continuously repeat the sell item command until I give the stop all command. So for the first, uh, first uh, command we do, we do a, a click left mouse button. So it'll click here first. 
and then because of my 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 resolution is what is it um i think it's 1920 by 1080 but like i said you can use all these numbers and test it out and if it doesn't work then you just gotta go in and tweak it and that's all so it's pretty easy to do i'll look i'll show you how to tweak it too but um so anyway the first command you have to do is hit the click left mouse button so that's the first command the second command we then move the mouse right 835 pixels so and then like i said you may have to adjust that depending on what your resolution is like so i'll edit that one so we can look at it so if you need to update it all you have to do is go in here and maybe change maybe make this a little bigger or a little smaller because you really want to get it directly above the cell button here and when i did this i actually did this one command at a time so i would do like the uh I would do the click mouse button, click left mouse button first, which is easy enough to do. And then I would start working on trying to get the mouse to move to what I think is the correct position above the uh, cell button at the lower left, lower right corner. And then after we move it to the right, then we got to move it down. So then there's the move mouse left zero, relative mouse key down 270. And that'll move it, basically it'll take it down to here. And then we do the click left mouse button, which basically clicks the cell button. And then we move left 390, which just happens to be where the other cell button is over here. And then we click the left mouse button again on that cell button. And then we need to pause for five seconds because the back end is doing the actual processing of the sale. And so far, I, I've, I've run this a couple times and the five second rule seems to hold pretty well. Uh, I had problems with this in 13.7.1 sometimes it was a lot longer than five seconds sometimes it was like a second uh, and sometimes it failed so you know usually it failed after the first couple sales so i've been holding off on this macro showing everybody this macro until i felt comfortable that that it would actually work um so anyway so you pause five seconds and then you move left to come back over here again right about this position and then we move up, uh, back up to the center of where we started from. And what you can do, I mean, I guess you could do a little bit. You could actually use uh, definitely the the um, the up and down. You can subtract based on what you did over here. You can kind of figure out going up and down here. But I mean, like I said, it's going to be a lot of tweaking. It took me about an hour to work this macro out it wasn't wasn't too difficult especially since i'd already done it for uh, 3.17.1 um but anyway once you get all these commands in then you, you and i think this is already checked for you but you got to make sure you get i would test it first with just um execute only once do that until you feel comfortable that it works correctly so you basically sell you you will say sell item it'll do it once and then if you want to sell another one, you got to say it again. But once you feel comfortable that that is working correctly, just come down here and change this to repeat continuously until it stopped. And which means that it won't stop until you say stop all or whatever your stop command is. So like I said, I'll post all of these in the description, all these commands. Um, and if you've seen my other videos, you should be able to create these commands. Uh, you definitely, if you like, if you reviewed, if you saw my inventory, uh, move inventory macro these are very very i think i used all these commands for move inventory i don't think any of these are new except for possibly the pause uh, which is this guy right here so you can say uh, add a pause and you can tell for how long like i said i did it for five seconds which seems to work so that is pretty much it for um selling items and like i said it works it works pretty well uh, here, let's do it again. Sell item. So yeah, so I can go through here and I can just sell scopes all day. And just this makes it so much easier than having to manually do it. So that pretty much wraps up uh, wraps up uh, uh, this episode on how to sell items 
on the new uh, new uh, screens uh, that we'll be having tomorrow when 3.17.2 drops. So I'm really looking forward to it. I can't wait. And I will see you in the verse. Thanks for watching and have a great day.